Hey, yo, what's going on, guys? J Mac here, and today I'm going to teach you guys how to set up bots on Black Ops 4 for trick shotting. As I'll show you, uh, this is not going to be like how we used to do it on Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 2 with Capture the Flag. This one actually requires Search and Destroy, and is a bit more of a pain, in my opinion, but uh, we'll still be able to set up bots. It's hard to set up, but yeah, let's, uh, let's jump right in. As you'll notice, once you open up the Black Ops 4 menu, you'll see that you can open up multiplayer and control, but this will take you to the public match. This is for private match trick shotting. So what you want to do is you want to go to play local, and it'll take a bit to load, but once that's done, you just click multiplayer, and you're in your, you're in your little private match. It's weird. I don't think you can do private match with people. I haven't checked yet. Uh, no one's online. It's actually 2 a.m., but uh, let's, let's jump right in. So... What you'll need is search and destroy, um, and then just choose a map where the bomb, I guess, is near a trick shot spot. So I tested this out on firing range where the bomb isn't perfect, but um, we'll try out. Oh, where's the where's a perfect spot for the bomb? We got um slums summit. Yeah, we'll do summit. We'll do summit because um that will. That will help. So, so I'm just choosing Summit for this. Um, you might not have Summit, but whatever. You just choose a map. So what you do is you go to the the first settings. You change it to, to unlimited time limit and unlimited round wins. Because you want as many rounds and time to trick shot. Uh, that's not very important. Um, or actually, switch sides to never. Um which is what you want uh, num now this is important number of lives is unlimited once that's done you go to specialist settings and you go down to the health and damage and you set the health obviously to 30 because why would you want a hit marker uh, and then you can do friendly fire the most important thing friendly fire enabled now this is pretty this is pretty basic for most of you if you've done private match trick shotting before um, but the next part you will really need to listen to because it's the most important part about setting up the bots Which it actually took me like 20 30 minutes to actually figure out how to do this. So let's um, let's get into that bit So as you can see the bot settings are very very weird and you've got lobby settings and all this jazz It's really weird and when you add a bot It actually adds it to the opposite team and then same with that And if you keep adding bots, you'll just see that it just stacks up so what you want to do is you want to have three on each three on each side including yourself use the d-pad to go over to the enemy team press a and that lets you swap it now when you press a you like it's really hard to see but it became highlighted down on remove bot okay so you go you every time you press a you'll start on the remove bot so you just go up go across and you bring it down to your team and you just keep doing that now it's a bit of a hassle but if you're private match trick shotting you you're doing it for a bit so i mean you, you either you either you're either doing it for a video or you, it's you're taking some time now i don't know if you can save yet we can have a look if you can save but i'm pretty sure there's no saving yeah there's there's no saving right now, but so bots put it on recruit lobby settings. Uh, that's that's the best I can do, and B and you're done. You can set it up, and you guys know the rest. You just choose whatever you want. So I'm gonna choose the ruin, obviously, and you just gotta wait. There's I don't I couldn't find any settings to shorten the timer or anything like that. But that that's what you can do. And now this is the fun. This is the really fun part where you have to actually beat the bots to the bomb and obviously see he got the bomb so he's gonna plant it because he's a bot and he's retarded so what you do you just you just kill him it's just simple as that and you got the bomb boom so you just being around the bomb side will bring all the bots to you so as you can where's the where's the map as you can see most of the bots are around me there's one or two just camping somewhere else um there's not many you can have sadly it's a bit it's very trick shot limited um, but it's how you set up bots if you really want to set up bots and whatnot. I know most of you will be playing online trying to hit build cams and stuff, but yeah, let's, I'm going to try to hit a trick shot for this uh, video now. Oh, I feel like I, I, I should have said this before. 
if you want to change class, obviously you have the bomb. Um, you can just kill yourself by suiciding and whatnot. So you just like, say I want to change class, just go to, oh, okay, well, say for example, I choose a class. Just, you just kill yourself and you'll respawn in a few seconds. I mean, it takes time, but you'll, you'll respawn eventually and you can just go grab the bomb again. And I think there's a, I think there's a time you can change you can change your respawn time. I haven't done that. Uh, if you can't, you can't. But yeah, just you just gotta look into the settings. Use your brain. Um, but yeah. Come on. There we go. Okay, I hit a shitty little shot, but now I can show you guys kill cam. Quick game. Boom. Draw. And so just say draw. Host any game. Whatnot. Yep. And it should come up with the kill cam being the last kill instead of the knife kill that I got and boom oh cool I didn't even realize I did a quick cock quick <laughs> whoops that doesn't map move that in alright guys hope you enjoyed like comment just subscribe all that cringy shit and just make sure to share it around all that jazz uh, subscribe if you're new and follow my twitter it's in the description later guys peace